hi guys welcome back if you're new here my name is Renee John if you're my old subscriber thank you so much for subscribing to my channel or watching my videos my channel focuses mostly on fashion and lifestyle but mainly fashion for now because we're still quarantining in South in California so thank you guys for watching my videos and coming back Today I have a brand new video, it's all about sunglasses, my sunglass collection. So without further ado, let's get started. The very first one in my collection is these Gucci sunglasses. I got this about six months ago at the sunglass hot store inside of Macy's. I was minding my business, going by my way, and I look in the corner of my eye. There's like 30% of all sunglasses except um Tiffany I said wait all the brands though like yes I was like oh, no like I have a soft spot when I say I have a soft spot for sunglasses I do so I went ahead and tried this on and it captivated me I was like Remy you cannot leave this place without buying these sunglasses and let me try it on for you guys look at this bad boy okay when I wear glasses I just feel very beautiful like I feel, I feel very sophisticated and elegant at the same time like yes love everything about it super big which I love the bigger the closer you are to God yes I love that very big frame very steady love it it has a little Gucci logo right here but it's small and, and it's, I feel it's two tone so it's a little bit lighter down here and darker up here but the sunglasses is brown it's not black i love this bad boy it is other bad boy is tom ford i think i got this the same day i purchased the gucci one this one is black on black on black on black on black okay very steady the hands are a little bit thicker love it it's giving me like matrix vibe like in the movie matrix or james bond i feel like i'm in the movie james bond or matrix with these sunglasses let me go ahead and try it on for you guys look at this one it's very steady these sunglasses is steady like it's the type of sunglasses if you wear it and you jump you run it's not moving like it's stuck literally stuck in your face it doesn't move the arms that it, it kind of like hugs your face you know and I just love that about the sunglasses what do you guys think let me go ahead and show you guys the next one the next one is still Tom Ford one of my favorite I, I know I said the first one was one of my favorite yes this one is one of my favorite too this is how it looks like have the it have the Tom Ford logo right here um it's black but the, it goes to two-tone color down here let me go ahead and try it on for you guys look at this I like I literally just love these sunglasses I have these sunglasses is I would say one of my favorites and I wear it so many times like literally like if you follow me on IG or Facebook um, you will definitely see these sunglasses in one of my pictures or two or three or four yes that's how much I love these sunglasses what do you guys think let me go ahead and show you guys the very next one in my collection so the very next sunglasses is this is this Givenchy sunglasses is brown um, I got this from Ned Apote about I say seven months ago is brown one thing I don't love about the sunglasses is the arm okay for a sunglasses that have a thicker arm I don't know why I feel like the arms are a little shaky I feel like I need to take it so they can screw because it has little screws right here so they can make it a little bit tighter the arms are shaky a little bit it's not very steady which I'm a little bit surprised because if sunglasses most of the time if the arm is this thick it's pretty steady you know let me go ahead and try it on so you guys can see how it looks like love it 
love. I just, I'm obsessed. Okay. Most of the time, I usually wear my more expensive sunglasses if I'm going somewhere um, a little bit, how can I say it? If I'm hanging out with friends, I'm going to an event, I'm going to a wedding, you know, that's when I really wear my expensive sunglasses. But if I just want to run errands, if I just want to run errands and hang out like around my house or um, just running errands and doing things, you know, around my neighborhood, I don't wear my expensive sunglasses. Sometimes I do, but most of the time I don't because I don't want to get them damaged or anything like that. So the collection is this black, all black. It's called Berry. It's a brand called Chimmy. Black on black on black on black again. I absolutely love these sunglasses, okay? It's not as expensive as the other one. It was like, I think under $100 or $100. But it's kind of giving me like Celine vibe. I know Celine have something similar to this. So, but I just love this. My two favorite brands when it comes to sunglasses is Celine and Tom Ford. Those are my two favorite brands. But I still have different sunglasses. So it doesn't mean I don't wear different sunglasses, but those are my two favorite for now. I might change my mind. I'm a woman, I'm allowed to change my mind anytime, okay? So let me go ahead and change. <laughs> let me go ahead and try this one for you guys. Black on black on black on black on black. Okay, look at this. It's giving me very rich anti vibe. Like it's giving me very rich anti vibe. Like ooh, she look like she got money. I'm just kidding. But when I wear these sunglasses, that's the kind of vibe that it's giving me, which I love. And it was not that expensive. Like, I'm shocked. And all these sunglasses in this collection are AV protected. So, they protect you from the sun. Yep. What do you guys think? Let me go ahead. You guys are going to laugh at me like what the ratchet is going on, okay? But <laughs> this is my very first designer sunglasses and I'm not ready to let it go anytime soon. I'm like, you're not going anywhere. I still love you. You're still part of me. I don't want you to go. Can you stay with me forever? It's this silly number. This used to be my favorite, okay? These sunglasses used to be my favorite. When I first got this, whew, I was wearing this like every day. Like literally every day I was wearing these sunglasses. Every day. But now it's broken. I know, it's ghetto, but I just wanted to show you guys. It was very, this is my first designer sunglasses. If you consider, um, Raven some um, designer then it's not but if you don't consider it designer designer then this is my very first designer is I've had these sunglasses for a very long time and I am going to go take it so they can fix it I know they can fix it because I have done it with one of my other sunglasses before so I'm gonna take it so they can fix it for me because I'm not ready like I'm literally not ready to part way with these sunglasses they're gonna fix it for me I'm not ready I'm gonna be ready when I'm self ready but for now I'm not ready to let these sunglasses go so it's not going anywhere one is this the very next one is this Chloe sunglasses shape is a little different it's round the color is brown it has this gold detailing on the side the arm is very steady, you know. The thing is, most of the time when I buy sunglasses, I try to stay away from the arms like this. The reason is, they're skinny, they are not steady to me. I've had a couple of sunglasses with the arms like this. They're not steady to me, so I try to stay away from them. But when I order this, I got this from Netaporte too. This is steady. When I tell you these sunglasses is steady, it's steady. It's well made. And the frame is so thick. Like, the lens is very, very thick. 
let me go ahead and try it on for you guys look at this bad boy the gold detailing right here this round i usually don't wear round round um sunglasses but you know what i was like let me try it you know and i love it i absolutely love it i love the color it's still kind of giving me like 70 vibes which i love yes what do you guys think one is this ceiling sunglasses okay remember when i said i don't like getting sunglasses with this skinny frame i mean this skin skinny hand this is what i'm talking about this sunglasses the hand is not steady okay and i don't like that i feel like each time i wear these sunglasses i have to like I, my hand is always in my face not a lot but it's in my face trying to adjust it that's how i feel when i um wear these sunglasses but it's a bad boy too like you can't go wrong with this let me grab i think this was the second designer sunglasses i purchased love it the color is just beautiful like i said i like that two-tone color i just i feel like it looks better on me and that's what i like and if you guys notice most of my sunglasses are square face i've, I've never had a cat eye sunglasses i tried it before i feel like it looks ugly on me so um i don't wear cat eye sunglasses i do wear um aviators but they are all broken somewhere they were very bad i don't know where they are is this um fair gamo it doesn't have a name inside i don't care like literally i don't care for these sunglasses i've had it for like four years and i literally forgot forgot that i had these sunglasses for some reason because i don't wear it um i've worried you guys might think differently different maybe you guys might think different from from me you know i just think it doesn't look good on me it, maybe it might it might just be in my head you know but let me go ahead and try it on it's black brown the reason i feel like it doesn't look good on me because my face is pretty round i feel like i have a round face i feel like round face and round sunglasses it just make me look like I don't know i feel like round face round sunglasses it doesn't look good on me it might just be in my head but yeah but the sunglasses is really nice very steady very well made so we'll see maybe i'll love it again maybe not the very next one is the same brand like one of the other ones i tried earlier it's called chimmy this one is called this one is still called berry 03 still giving me black on black on black like i love it these sunglasses is always in my car this is my everyday running errands this is the sunglasses i wear it's usually in my car i just brought it up so i can show you guys in this collection but yes this is my everyday sunglasses when i'm running errands or if i'm going anywhere it's always in my car and there's too much sun outside you know sometimes when you're driving the sun is just too much this is always in my car so what do you guys think black on black on black let me go ahead and show you the very next one is the same brand as the first as the last previous one i just showed chimmy this one is a little bit more square face it's square giving me very metrics like i'm in a james bond movie or i'm about to be on metrics which i love you know i feel like you can't go wrong with uh black sunglasses when i mean black like all black like the frame the lens everything is just black i feel like you can't go wrong with you can't go wrong with that at all I just love it it's kind of giving me like Celine vibe I know when Celine Celine has um, Celine have some glasses that have you know this little thing these little dots here on the side but 
I still love it. I love, love, love it. Still gonna keep it. Collection is this round sunglasses. I got this one from Notion Brack. This and the other Chimmy sunglasses are my everyday sunglasses. If I'm not wearing that one, I'm wearing this one. But sometimes I'll be forgetting that I have the sunglasses. The 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 lens is reflective. But it kind of feel like it's a mirror, but it's not a mirror. I don't know if you guys understand me. Um, this bra this one is Diane von Furstenberg DVF. So um, it doesn't have no name. It's just a DVF inside, and then on the side on the hand, it's a Diane von Furstenberg. So let's go ahead and try this bad boy on for you guys. Round. Okay. You guys are gonna say, "Ben, you say you don't like round sunglasses." This is round for some reason. I like this. For some reason, I love these round sunglasses more than the Fairy Gamma one. I don't know why. You know, I think you guys can see that it's, um, it has like a mirror effect. Maybe because it's not outside on the sun, but when I wear it on the um, outside when it's sunny, it kind of gives you that mirror effect outside. Um, we've come to the end of my sunglasses collection. Please let me know below which one was your favorite and i'm gonna link the names of all the sunglasses the, the brands because most of the sunglasses are sold out i don't think they have them but i will try my best to link any of them that i find but if i don't find any i'm just gonna put the names of the sunglasses in the description box and please if you don't have sunglasses in your closet trust me invest in one you don't have to buy a designer sunglasses you can literally buy one from forever 21 or um, H&M it doesn't have to be expensive at all buy one give it a try and you might fall in love with it like I love sunglasses and my collection is still growing I have like about three or four sunglasses in my 2021 wish list that I'm hoping praying to God that I can buy it but if I can it's okay too so thank you guys again for watching my name is Remy John please subscribe to my channel and then follow me on Instagram at the Remy Nash thank you guys so much and I'll see you guys on my next video Mwah.